Newcastle United needed three points against Leicester City to secure their top-flight status and they achieved that objective. Two goals from John Joe Shelby and a Jose Perez were enough to give the Magpies a 2-1 victory over Leicester. The first half was largely dominated by Newcastle, and the second half was comprised of aggression and high energy from both sides. The level of competition in this match made it entertaining until the final whistle. Here are five things we learned from Newcastle's victory at the King Power Stadium. Newcastle's defenders secured all three points for the club, as they frustrated Leicester City's attack for most of the match. Paul Dummett and company completely shut down their opposition. This tight defending from Newcastle's back four prevented Jamie Vardy and Riyad Mahrez from roaming freely in the penalty area, which hindered Leicester's efficiency. In 2018, Newcastle United have shown that they have one of the best defensive units in the Premier League. Vardy's tapping goal late in the second half was the first time Newcastle conceded a goal in more than a month. Top player, John Joe Shelby John Joe Shelby's ability to lead his side to victory made the match against Leicester City more enjoyable. The 26-year-old took control of the game from the opening whistle, and the defensive midfielder was comfortable playing attacking football. His goal in the 18th minute to give the Magpies a 1-0 lead set the tone for the rest of the match. Moreover, Shelby's ability to switch the field and pick out teammates from distance confirmed that he is a prominent facilitator. With an interesting match against Arsenal up next, expect to see Shelby hustling in the middle third of the pitch for 90 minutes. Confident attack Newcastle United have struggled in terms of scoring goals this but this was not the case on Saturday. Behind the efforts of John Joe Shelby and the Jose Perez, the Magpies managed to find the back of the net twice on the road. Scoring multiple goals in a crucial away match against a quality opponent is a positive sign for Newcastle with six matches remaining. Leicester City's defence had no answer for Newcastle's attack, and this should serve as a boost of motivation for the Magpies next weekend. Composure time and time again this, supporters and pundits have witnessed Newcastle collapse when taking early leads. However, Rafa Benita's men were able to maintain their composure in the second half of the match on Saturday. Yes, Vardy did score a late goal and revived some of Leicester City's hope, but the Magpies did well in maintaining possession deep into stoppage time. Composure is something that the Magpies lacked all, but hopey this trend of playing calm football will continue through mid-May. Toonami support their clubs with much larger fan bases in England with global networks, but the Toonami are unique. The unwavering support that the Toonami expressed at the King Power Stadium is what pushed the Magpies over the top. The endless chance served as motivation for the 11 men in striped jerseys. With only six matches left in the, this vocal support from the Toon Army will assist the Magpies in their final three away matches. With matches at Everton, Tottenham and Watford still on the schedule, we can expect three more sold-out away sections.